Hello and welcome to Alex Attempts Tabletop. Today I'm going to show you how to paint Hallow Knights and the footage from this video is used from my recent Twitch stream. There's a link in my description if you want to catch the action live. I stream regularly two to three times a week. And on screen, here are the paints for today's painting tutorial so you can pause, check it out and go back over it. Let's get painting. So I primed the model with Lead Belcher and now I'm applying Retributor Armor to the armor panels, the shield panels, and you can see as the painting tutorial goes along. It's pretty easy, this first approach, because we're building up the metallics to lead up to an awesome dry brush, which helps speed up the entire painting scheme for this method of Hallowed Nights. It's pretty rad. Next, I apply Nun Oil to tone down the lead belcher and the Retributor armor, which will give depth and it will come into play later to make the rest of the paint scheme pop because it's a quick easy scheme but it's also very efficient and has great results. I did this in like two hours which is pretty good for single character. And here I'm just about to say use a hairdryer if you've got the chance because it will dry the wash quicker. And also now on screen I'm just going to quickly thank my Patreons today. These guys are great if you've been ever interested to support the channel. Check out my Patreon now. Let's go back to the actual paint guide. That was a really badly timed ad break. So now I'm dry brushing Necron Compound. Don't dry brush crazily, but dry brush just enough to make everything pop as you can see here. It's looking good. Keep dry brushing Alex. There I go. I'm brushing away. Now we're going to start filling in block colours. We're doing Screamer Pink, so that's going to be on the sword handle, the robes, and the plume on top of the helmet. So originally the leather was brown, but I thought to save time on the paint scheme, we're just going to do it scream pink and actually turned out quite nicely. As the whole point of this scheme is to speed things up, but have it look nice for tabletop standard when you're playing in tournaments. And now we're using Cantar Blue, so we're going to use that for the shield and the cape. And then if you're painting a normal Stormcast, you're going to paint the shoulder pads both blue. But this guy has a fancy gold line on his, so I only did one shoulder pad, gold. Gold? Blue, you know what I mean. But you just got to be careful, go around, and what I like to say on all my painting tutorials, if you make a mistake, don't worry, go back. The beauty of me using stream footage, I made mistakes, and I went back and touched up during the stream, I got a bit of gold and silver. And I painted up again with Lead Belcher, so don't be afraid if you make a mistake, things happen, you know. Finally, for the scrolls and the scroll bit on the shield, we used Ushanti Bone. I went a bit silent there because I needed to breathe and yeah, I forgot what to say and I can't be bothered to edit this out. But yeah, just bang on that Ushanti bone on the scrolls. I would say two thin coats because it's quite a light paint, you know? There I go. It's really satisfying watching this back in like times 500 speed. And now we apply Agrax Earthshade. No, I'm joking. More non oil. I can't believe I said Agrax Earthshade. It's non oil now in all the trims around the shield, around the shoulder pads, but then we also do use Agrax Earth Shade, or you can use non oil on the scrolls. It depends what you want. If you want to speed up the process and use one less wash, just use non oil on the scroll. It looks great. And we're going to lead up now to the finished job. Ah, oh, look at me go, all sped up. And there you go, that's the guy dried. I said I used my hair dryer to dry it off a bit. And now I'm going to show you some still shots of what it looks like in an attempt to make it look fancy. So there you go. You can see the metallics there. They really help everything else pop out. And here's an entire squad. Hopefully you liked this video. It's quick, easy, really simple. I kind of vibe this approach. Hopefully you found it helpful. And you can check out the videos. You can like, comment and subscribe or do whatever you want. Want to see me paint something particular in the future? then a great way is to contact me on my socials and maybe I'll do it because I'm nice. Anyway, till next time, you guys take care. Goodbye.